The primary reason we're here is that the Alamo is unquestionably the most important piece of Texas history in the state. And we can do better. As such, the Alamo occupies a very interesting place, not only in history, but in the physical space of our city. And we believe that it should be among the most well-regarded and revered locations in the country and the world. Our expectation is that this process gets us and it to a place where it is looked upon in the same way that, let's say, Gettysburg or the Presidio or Pearl Harbor or the Statue of Liberty is regarded. That is what we're going for. What that looks like, how that's done, that's why we're here. That's what the process is for. But in general, we believe that we can do better. And you are a very important and necessary part of that. And your presence here means a great deal to all of us. Hi, my name is Michael. I'm with Nowcast SA. And I am with Sue Ann Pemberton. Correct. And um, what is your title? I am the, one of the tri chairs for the Alamo Plaza Advisory uh, Committee. Okay. So, what uh, happened here today? What was this uh, meeting of the um, community all about? It was an opportunity for public input into uh, the mission, vision, and guiding principles of the Alamo Plaza uh, area and the, the, the future of that, the future interpretation and uh, redevelopment of that area. Okay. And um, what is the next step in the process? We'll uh, take the information that was gathered today and we will be kind of refining some of those uh, guiding principles that were generated before and we will uh, be moving it to um, the quality of life for, within the city city's uh, uh, structure and then it'll go eventually to City Council for their review but we have several other opportunities to kind of refine what was done here today. So. Okay, do you know when it's going to be going to the City Council for review? I don't remember that date exactly, no, okay. sorry. That's okay. And um, it, the idea is that the, we'll be requesting proposals from a master planner by December of this year. So that, uh, uh, but the, what was done this evening will help to guide what they will end up doing for design. Okay. Okay, that sounds great. Uh, thank you very much. Okay. So if the people have ideas or suggestions, um, you know, how can their voices be heard? Well, Nowcast has been wonderful in having that comment area on uh, on the website. In addition to that, sanantonio.gov, if you go to Alamo Plaza, there's an opportunity there to comment. Um, and that those will all be taken into consideration. I've got to um, put all that together so that the committee can take a look at all of those comments. Okay, and how long do you think the whole process will take? Which part of the whole process? Uh, I mean, uh, from I guess from today until the final uh, vote uh, uh, happens. Well, we're hoping that City Council will give the green light to go ahead and s solicit requests for qualifications by the beginning of the year, um, around the first part of the new year, January, February. Then. We will submit that, um, we'll circulate that, hopefully four or five, maybe six firms, who knows, will um, put forth information that the, and their qualifications to be considered. And then the committee will then, um, with others, select um, a firm or group. An architecture firm or what oh, kind? No, it could be architecture, could be a planning firm, could mm -hmm. be a combination team of architects and planners and interpretive specialists, not sure. Even archaeology? Oh yeah, okay. um, you have to have historical experts on the team, so that's up to whoever responds to the request for qualifications. Once that group is selected, whoever that might be, probably um, in summer or fall of 2015, maybe fall of 2015, then um, they'll get to work. There'll be more public meetings, there'll be um, more opportunities for people to help shape what they're interested in now pleasant looking like and what they want the experience to be, that's going to be really important to inform the planners in what direction to go in. Okay. Well, thank you very much. You're welcome.